We're hearing all about social distancing as a tactic to try to slow down the spread of the coronavirus. As schools are closing down, health experts are advising parents and students not to take this measure lightly. Here's how. From schools to museums to amusement parks, closures and daily disruptions from the coronavirus have become the new norm. I do think it is the right thing to do right now and um, we are facing a crisis and I think this will help. Dr. Lisa Maragakis, epidemiologist at Johns Hopkins Medicine in Baltimore, says even if you don't have symptoms, staying away from crowds and keeping your distance from others should be the mindset for now. Social distancing, a new buzzword. It's anything from not shaking hands, not hugging and kissing someone, uh, to really just leaving more space between our yourself and someone else. Around six feet is what health experts recommend. And while some states like here in Maryland are shutting down schools, doctors say that doesn't mean completely changing your way of life. Gathering in small groups is still uh, going to occur and I think is entirely appropriate. We just all need to be very vigilant about anyone who has symptoms of respiratory disease. Dr. Maragakis cautions any symptoms, even mild ones, should be taken seriously, meaning parents and individuals need to stay on alert and stay home when sick. It's not a vacation. There's a very serious reason uh, for the school cancellations. This is not a time for um, any of us to get together in large gatherings outside of work or outside of school. Health experts say the goal here is not only to keep yourself safe, but to protect the more vulnerable in your community who are at risk for severe disease. Natalie Brand, CBS News, Baltimore, Maryland. All right, well, don't go anywhere. We'll be right back.